What's up guys? Today's video, we are eating my most favorite fast food items for 24 hours. I've actually had a lot of you guys ask me to do this video, which I was shocked, but hey, if you guys want to see me eat all my favorite items for the entire day, I will definitely not say no. So the first place that we were getting is Chick-fil-A, and Chick-fil-A is a restaurant that I go to off camera. Usually I do save my fast food indulgences for YouTube since I film so many videos, but I do love Chick-fil-A off camera as well. So we're going to head over there and I'm gonna get my favorite combo this is my go-to meal at Chick-fil-a it's so delicious there are a few change-ups to the combo to make it my own but yeah I will see you guys over at Chick-fil-a for our first meal Daisy, how can, I today? can I do a grilled chicken sandwich please yes, just the sandwich or the meal? um I'll do the meal but can I get that with the potato chips Absolutely. and can I get the sandwich with a white bun please Yes, ma'am. and then can I also do the creamy salsa dressing yes ma'am and for the drink, I'll do a large soda water. Awesome. Perfect. Will that be all for you today? Yep, that's going to be it. All right. It'll be 11.20 for you. Yes, ma'am. You're all set to go. Okay, in. thank you. Okay, so you guys heard how I ordered it. I will kind of explain what I got once I get the food. So let me get our order and then we will dive in. I can't wait to show you guys this meal because it's truly delicious. Hi, did you say Daisy? Yes. yes. Thank you. Have a good day. All right, you guys. We secured our Chick-fil-A bag. Okay, let me get parked somewhere good, and we will try out this food. All right, you guys. Here's our Chick-fil-A bag. Now, first off, we are going to start with the drink. If you want to do it the Daisy way, you got to get a soda water. <laughs> if you don't know what soda water is, it's just carbonated water. I will say a lot of people don't like soda water, but I love it. It's amazing. And Chick-fil-A has really good soda water. Mmm, so delicious. Okay, now for the food. So what we got is a grilled chicken sandwich, but instead of the multi-grain bun that they put on here, I like to get the buttered white bun. This bun absolutely changes the game for this sandwich. It makes it so much better. And then we are also going to take the creamy salsa dressing and put it onto the sandwich. It is a 10-10 combination. It's so good. Now, if you don't love grilled chicken sandwiches, if you want to make it a little bit more interesting, you can also add bacon to this, which makes it really good. I think you can just get like the grilled chicken club and that comes with bacon, or you can just do this with a regular Chick-fil-A sandwich with the fried chicken. But I really like the grilled chicken with the creamy salsa dressing. Okay, and then we have waffle potato chips. These are the best chips ever. I am usually not a lover of plain chips, but something about Chick-fil-A's waffle chips are incredible. They are so crunchy and salty and delicious. They look just like their fries, but in chip form. Oh my gosh. They're so good. Okay, here is the sandwich. And then we are going to take the creamy salsa. We're gonna pour the creamy salsa onto the sandwich. Okay, so there is the chicken sandwich with the creamy salsa dressing. It looks so good. Let me tear off some of the lettuce because Chick-fil-A's lettuce goes hard. <laughs> they always give you ginormous pieces. Okay, let's take a bite. Mmm, mm-hmm. It's so good, you guys. Now, I will say, if I were to do a celebrity meal with Chick-fil-A, I would definitely make this sandwich a regular Chick-fil-A sandwich instead of the grilled. Just because I feel like that appeals more to the masses. I feel like with celebrity meals, they do go with a lot of basic items. That way they get more people to like go buy it, you know? But the grilled chicken sandwich is still very yummy. 
It's also good to take your dressing and put more on the sandwich, like as you bite into it. That way every bite is saucy. But it's not like super messy as you eat it. Okay. That is a 10 out of 10 sandwich. Just saying. These chips, delicious. I mean, of course you can just get their fries, but at some point you need to try these if you haven't because they're so good. All right, you guys. Well, that was my go-to meal at Chick-fil-A. I'm going to take one more bite of the sandwich for the road. Try this out with the creamy salsa dressing. It's fabulous. And the white bun. <laughs> the white bun with our grilled chicken sandwich. Like I said, it's a game changer. Let me know what you guys think of my Chick-fil-A order. Is it something that you personally would try out? But I will see you guys at our next stop for more of my favorite fast food items. Okay, before we head off to our next stop, I want to thank today's sponsor, which is Factor. I absolutely love Factor. If you haven't heard of them before, they are a meal delivery service that delivers ready to eat meals straight to your doorstep. Now you can of course eat these meals for dinner time, but I love Factor for lunch, whether you work from home or you go to a workplace every day as long as you have access to a microwave you can heat up the meal within minutes and eat it straight away and because there's no prep involved the meal turns out amazing every single time so whenever you get your factor meals they come in a box you can choose the amount of meals that you get each week it comes just like this peel back the plastic pop it in the microwave, heat it up for two to three minutes, and it is ready to enjoy. So today, I think I'm going to make, let's see, I have quite a few in front of me here. I think I'm gonna make this one, which is sun-dried tomato. I love this one. This one is absolutely delicious. And also another great thing about Factor is you do get to choose your meals each week. They have over 30 dietitian approved meals that you can choose from. Choose the meals that you want. They come in the box and then you can enjoy for the week. Okay, so here's the Factor meal. I'm going to pop it into the microwave and I'm going to go ahead and put it on for three minutes. Usually I like to make my Factor meal in the oven, but we are in the process of moving. So a lot of our kitchenware has been moved over to the new house so I'm just gonna use it in the microwave today which I feel like is probably the more popular option here's our completed factor meal and another good thing is you can eat it directly out of the container which is nice because let's say you take it with you to work you don't have to worry about having plates or anything like that okay let's give this a bite I'm gonna try the chicken on its own first oh, it's hot mmm <laughs> I've personally never disliked a factor meal that I've received. They're always super flavorful. You also get a really good variety with the meals because you get a protein like the chicken plus a vegetable. So it's a very balanced meal. Mmm. If you guys are interested in trying out Factor for the first time, I do have a discount code. All you have to do is go to factor75.com and use the code daisysu 50 to get 50% off your first box, which makes it very affordable to at least try to see if you enjoy it. So thank you to Factor for sponsoring today's video. All right, you guys, our second stop is Burger King. Of course, this would not be my all-time favorite fast food items without including Burger King. Now, Burger King is my favorite fast food restaurant of all of them I would say and I was gonna save this until last but I don't think it's a surprise to anyone that Burger King is included in this video I am always raving about them so I'm gonna be getting all of my favorite items at Burger King to make like my go-to meal here so I think it's gonna be pretty good I will check in with you guys once we get up to the register because we are currently in a very long line our BKs are always popping I know that there's like a franchise going out of business right now but the franchise is here in North Carolina, they are still on and popping. Hi, um, can I get a number one combo with onion rings? And can I get that with a small diet Coke? Can I also get an order of chicken fries, please, with some zesty sauce? Four, eight, or twelve. I'll do four. Would that complete your work? Yep, that's gonna be it. Twelve or four, please. Okay, thank you. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? Here you go. 
Oh, can I tap it? Oh, perfect. Um, no, that's okay. Thank you. Have a good day. Hi, I'm good. How are you doing? Thank you, you too. All right, you guys, we secured our Burger King bag. I'm actually pulling up into a parking spot right here. This is perfect. Okay, I am super excited about this order from Burger King. I just freaking love BK so much. The BK in our town just always throws it down with the fresh food, and so you really can't go wrong with it. So for the drink, we got a Diet Coke. Now, if the restaurant does not have soda water, or if I'm just not in the mood for soda water, then I'll get a Diet Coke. However, if they have a Coke Zero, then I will get Coke Zero. But yeah, we got Diet Coke. Very delicious. And then we have our Burger King bag. My three all-time favorite items at Burger King. The onion rings. Da, 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 da. I love BK onion rings. Mm. They're so good. So we got us some onion rings. We also got some chicken fries, which I absolutely love. And to go with the onion rings and chicken fries, we got zesty sauce. The zesty sauce is an absolute must. And then last up in our bag, of course, the amazing, fabulous Whopper. The Whopper is my favorite fast food cheeseburger. Oh no, I forgot to ask for something on my Whopper. I messed up my own order. Okay, so on the Whopper, I do like to get cheese, and I love Swiss cheese on the Whopper, so I meant to ask for Swiss cheese, but I forgot. Darn. <laughs> mm. These chicken fries with a zesty sauce, though, they are amazing. If you don't like zesty sauce, which I've gotten a lot of people say that they don't, I will never understand. It truly is the zestiest of all the sauces <laughs> that are like that specialty sauce. I love their zesty sauce. But yeah, their chicken fries are also really good with barbecue sauce. I'm just a big zesty lover. Their onion rings are so hot and crispy. Mm. They got like that fake onion paste on the inside, which I love. <laughs> Burger King onion rings are definitely the fakest out of all the onion rings, but they are still just so good. I love them. Okay, now for the Whopper. Let's go ahead and unwrap this. Oh! The only thing that it's missing is the cheese. I cannot believe I forgot to ask for cheese. Usually they ask you if you want cheese on the Whopper, but I think they were trying to get people in and out really fast because the line was super long. Mm. It's still so good. I kind of want to try dipping this in the zesty sauce, even though it has a bunch of mayonnaise already on it. <laughs> Burger King's chicken sandwiches are actually really good dipped in the zesty sauce. Oh, another thing that I love at Burger King is their Impossible Whopper. So if you're not super big on meat, their Impossible Whopper is just as good as their regular Whopper. Mmm. I just love that flame grilled flavor of their patties. And their toppings are always so fresh. Let me know what your guys' favorite item is at Burger King. I feel like the Whopper is definitely the most popular item. Oh. 
Oh yeah, quick side note, Gabe and I actually watched our first Christmas movie last night of the season. We watched a new Christmas movie on Netflix. It was called Best Christmas Ever. It was like your classic cheesy Christmas movie, but I absolutely loved it. <laughs> it was very cute to watch. And I thoroughly enjoyed it. Mmm. Oh my gosh, that bite was so good. The center of this Whopper where all the juices are with the pickles and the onion. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. Mm. That Whopper is just heaven, <laughs> BK heaven. All right, you guys, well, that was my favorite items at Burger King. Probably some of my favorite items out of all the fast food restaurants put together. I absolutely love those. Let me know what you thought about my order at BK. Again, I wanted to get cheese on the Whopper and it would have been Swiss. So that was the only thing that I missed. But besides that, that's what I would get. Okay, well, I will see you guys at our next fast food stop for more of my favorite fast food items. All right, you guys, it's now dinner time. And for dinner, we are getting Zaxby's. I believe Zaxby's is pretty common. I think most states have them so let's head over there and grab my go-to order all right thank you for holding go ahead with your order yeah no problem um can i do the wings and things combo please you want them traditional boneless i'll do boneless and yeah. can i do that with the sweet and spicy sauce and what's your drink with that i'll do a large water please what else for you ma'am and then could i also do uh this I think it's six piece of the boneless wings combo. Boneless wings come in five, 10, or 20. Oh, okay, I'll do five. And you want that in a meal? Yes, please. And I'll do that with sweet and spicy as well. And the drink with that? Um, Can I do that with the AHA drink? Oh, AHA? Yes. What else for you, ma'am? Um, And can I get that combo with Zach sauce? What, the boneless? Yes. No ranch, that? No ranch, just Zach sauce, please. What else for you? And then, could I do a side of the fried white cheddar bites? And that's gonna be it. Okay, your total be 26.53. Okay, thank you. Okay, so just the five piece boneless wings combo was mine. I also got Gabe his dinner, so he got the wings and things. That's his favorite combo for anyone wondering. Uh, Hi. Yes. 26.53. Sure, uh -huh. Oh, perfect, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much, you too. All right, you guys, we've secured our Zaxby's bag. I am so excited, it smells so good in there. Okay, Zaxby's, I mean, <laughs> If you haven't had Zaxby's before, I gotta say, like, you are kind of, kind of missing out. All right, you guys, here's our big Zaxby's bag. And what I love about Zaxby's is they have those big, fancy soda machines inside. So you can get pretty much any drink you can think of. You can get, like, Fanta, High C, the vitamin water. I love AHA, so I always get the AHA when I come to Zaxby's. Oh, wait, no, that's Gabe's water. <laughs> this is my aha okay let's go ahead and give this a sip cheers mm, so good i've had so much soda water today okay i just spilt it on my hoodie okay so in our bag we got the white is it fried fried white cheddar bites i think that's the name of them these are so good from Zaxby's. I mean, they're pretty much like any other cheese curd. Let's see if we can get a cheese pull. Ooh, those are hot. Mm. Oh my gosh. No cheese pull, but these are spectacular. Okay, this one's my combo. So my go-to combo at Zaxby's is the five-piece boneless wings. Get them tossed in the sweet and spicy sauce. It is so delicious. They give you Texas toast and then their french fries. <sighs> their french fries are to die for. They have this delicious seasoning on top. Oh my gosh. And then we also have Zax sauce, which is a must at Zaxby's. You cannot come 
to Zaxby's and not get Zax sauce. If you get this combo, it automatically comes with ranch. So make sure you say you want Zax sauce instead. I mean, you can get both, but the Zax sauce is where it's at. Ooh, it's so good. Take our boneless wing, dip it in the Zax sauce. This is the best thing ever. Also, the fries dipped in Zach sauce. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. The sweet and spicy boneless wings are not spicy at all. I would say they taste more of like a... It almost tastes more of like a sweet teriyaki flavor, but not teriyaki. That's not like a sweet orange flavor, kind of. Wow. Okay, so I just had a pretty long phone call, so I do not know where I just left off. But yeah, this meal is 10-10, you guys. I was kind of trying to decide between cookout or Zaxby's because I do love cookout, but what I love at cookout is a cheeseburger, and we just had a burger from Burger King. So I thought to show you guys some variety, we would get some boneless chicken. And honestly, like, Zaxby's really doesn't hit the spot like it's very indulgent but it is so worth it the zach sauce is so craveable mm. we should actually try a cheese bite with the zach sauce i don't know if those will go because the zach sauce has it's not sweet but it kind of has like a sweet twang to it also i wanted to get the funnel cake funnel is that what it was called i don't know did you guys see it on the menu it was like a funnel cake but i've never tried that before so it wouldn't really fit into my favorite fast food items when i haven't even tried it <gasps> i bet it'd be a new favorite though okay the cheese bites dipped in the zack sauce not bad those are actually pretty good mm. Okay, well that was Axby's. Honestly, if health was not a factor, this is something that I would eat every day if I could, honestly. <laughs> I think we are going to get one more fast food item that I have to count into this favorite fast food items for the whole day kind of video. I will see you guys over there. All right, you guys, we are at Taco Bell for our last item. Thanks for choosing Taco Bell, how can I help you? Hi, can I just get a two pack of the Cinnab Cinnabon Delights, please? Yes, ma'am, it's 244 at the window. Okay, thank you. Okay, this Taco Bell is such a vibe whenever it starts getting dark. Wow, the ambiance. All right, you guys, we secured our Taco Bell bag. The final item of this video, one of my most favorite fast food items ever. Now, I do have a lot of favorites at Taco Bell, like the Cheesy Gordita Crunch, love it. DLT Taco, love it. But I honestly <laughs> cannot eat much more food. I think the only room I have left in my stomach will fit these cinnamon delights. Here we go, they are so yummy. Let's take a bite. Mmm. They're so warm and gooey and cinnamony and super sweet. Oh, these are delicious. I just got me a modest two pack because that's pretty much all I needed. Mmm. <laughs> The filling on the inside. Wow. I think out of all the fast food desserts, the Cinnabon Delights from Taco Bell are the most consistent. Very delicious. I mean, you, you just cannot go wrong with them. Okay, so this was a really fun video. Obviously, this was not a difficult food challenge by any means. I just did this for fun. A lot of you guys have been asking to see my most favorite fast food items that are out there. So I thought, you know what, let's do it. I also hope you guys have a wonderful Thanksgiving and you have so much to be grateful for this year. I know I do. And I'm super excited to see family. I'm so thankful for everything this year has blessed me with. So yeah, it's an amazing time of year, but I love you guys so much please drop a thumbs up down below and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys